On this Thanksgiving Eve, here's a story that should make all of us thankful. It's about an unusual partnership that's saving tax dollars and lives. As King Fi's Linda Byron reports, it begins with second chances. Oh. You know that there's plenty of hunting breeds out there that are discarded in the shelters. Whether puppies or aging pooches, purebreds or energetic mixes, these dogs are society's throwaways. It's usually because they are too active and too high strung and too obsessive. They're here because they're difficult. Which is exactly what I like. Hi. Making it the perfect place. Hi, Misha. For dog trainer Melissa Larson. Oh yeah, what is that? To search for new recruits. What is that? The story on this one. Her screening method dog out. is deceptively simple. Push a ball. Find it. Find your ball. She's looking for dogs that find a tennis ball. Where'd it go? So alluring. Push your ball. You want that? Mm-hmm. Not so much. Good boy. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Yay! They'll engage their powerful nose to find it. He's looking around for the ball and not sniffing for the ball. Dog in. Not all dogs have what it takes, the instinct and interest to do the job. Good. A few do. That's what I love to see is their nose go up and down and you can tell when they catch a little bit of the odor. But the fact that she's still searching for it and she's not giving up, that's something that I love to see. Dogs that are driven. Oh, good girl. No matter how tough the task. They keep hunting for it using their nose. Good girl. This is a dog that I would definitely take for a few days. Good. Take to Boeing, start, start her training. Good girl. All right, so this is good for her. Get your ball, get your ball. Get it, get it, get it, get it. Training that takes place miles away in this old airplane simulator warehouse in Renton. This is our canine training area here at Boeing. Just kind of run her down this wall right here. We have an explosive detection unit. This is where we train our brand new dogs and new handlers. Um, Good dog, babe. I'm going to take the odor and put it more in a search environment. Here, canine teams are being trained to sniff out all kinds of bombs. TNT. Uh, PETN, RDX. The first step. Ammonium nitrate, you've got chlorates uh, and mixtures of all of that. Imprinting the immense variety of explosive odors. Good girl. On the dog's brain. Have the dog put their nose in the can. Good. Good. You are so smart. Ready? And knowing that they're inhaling odor at the same time. Good. And we immediately reward them. Nice. Nose in the can on source, and she gets another ball. Good girl. Once they learn finding bomb equals getting ball, they're on their way. It still gives me goosebumps when I see that light bulb go off. Good boy. Woo. Oh, I understand now. It's, it's thrilling. Boeing launched its canine unit after 9-11. It works perfect. Um, it was apparent that we needed to enhance our security measures. And one of the least expensive but highly effective methods is to deploy explosive detection canine teams. Search. <laughs> Come on. To search all inbound cargo. Good girl. And lured Melissa Larson away from the military police to run it. Uh, aircraft deliveries prior to being delivered to the customers are cleared. Cargo facilities, mail rooms. Good girl! We can cut her off there and we'll let her work. It wasn't long before police departments heard about the program and asked to see it. What we find is that our missions that we share are, are almost identical, and that's protecting people and property. The aerospace giant did one better. Good girl! Inviting police canine teams yeah. to train alongside Boeing. Good girl, good girl, good girl, good girl! But she's wanting to go back to work. For free. It's a great savings to them. It's a great networking opportunity for us. Mishka. Melissa even scours shelters to find their dogs. Yes, I see you have a tennis ball that came out. Well, Melissa's excellent at finding dogs. So. We have rescued a lot of dogs and, and turned them into uh, life-saving bomb dogs. Stay, Boomer, stay. Boomer was one of the program's early graduates. And as you can see, he's anxious to get going here because he knows something's up. This is a training exercise behind Let's SPD's gun range. And I'm gonna let him loose, search. Come here, Boomer, let's go. Boomer had bounced from shelter to shelter. Search. Before being saved 
and turned into a Seattle police superstar. He was a stray at pause. Boomer was amazing from, from the get-go. Where's it? Is it? Where's it? He found a, a weapon underneath, underneath some leaves. And he's a focus dog, so he will sit there and stare at the explosive or the weapon until he gets his reward, which is a ball on a string. Boomers helped catch real perps. Good boy, Boomer, good boy. I think 100% chance. If there's a gun there, Boomer's going to find it. Good boy, good boy, good boy. Just a phenomenal dog. Hit the scene. He even hits on a cabinet that once stored targets at the range. See? His nose is that sensitive. Good boy. These dogs can distinguish between some 20,000 odors. Where we smell a pizza, they smell the onions, the cheese, every single spice separately. <laughs> Boomer is fearless. He'll jump up on anything. Search. It's all the same Good to boy. him. Boomer is like the Energizer Bunny. You never have to uh, get him motivated to work. Because it's about the ball. Good boy, Boomer, good boy! So the only time he gets that ball is if he finds an explosive. It's always good boy. about the ball. Good boy. He'd probably starve. If he had to choose between food and a ball, he'd go for the, he'd go for the ball every time. Give me that, give me that. Good boy, good boy, good boy. A trained bomb dog can easily run a police department 15 grand. Search here. SPD got Boomer from Paws for a hundred bucks. Search. He's forged a trail for social castaways becoming canine heroes. Good boy. Who's a superstar? Dogs like Jazzy. She washed out of a, a hunting club or kennel uh, somewhere. She's destined to join Boomer at SPD. Yay, Jazzy! Don't put it in there. Storm's headed there, too. Ready? He came from Paws. A Rottweiler Black Lab Mix. He actually, out of all the dogs, reminds me of Boomer in the training process. So did Harley. She's going to the UW. Uh, she has a lot of energy. She is probably our most challenging dog. Very good. But Boeing is keeping bay. An abused dog Melissa pulled off Craigslist. Very good, babe. All dogs that didn't fit in the world, now making our world safer. If you just let the dog do what they're trained to do, hunt for the odor they're trained to hunt for. Where's it? Good boy. They'll save your life every time. Good boy, good boy. Good boy. Linda Byron, King 5 News. Good boy.